Hola mga Lakers! Welcome back! If you are new to my channel, my name is Sir Kevin. I am an ICT coordinator and instructor in junior high school. I'm also an advocate of the Techie program. My goal is to share my knowledge and skills about educational technology, most especially to my fellow teachers. I upload videos every twice a week. So if you are interested in learning about educational technology, subscribe now and hit that notification bell so you will be updated on my latest video. We are now on part 4. If you want to check previous parts, just click the caption above. I made series of videos for me to show you how you can use Google Classroom. For this video, I'm going to show you how you can create and give questions to your students. In your Google Classroom, go to Classwork tab. Then, click Create button. Choose the word question. Here, choose the type of question you prefer. You have two options, either short answer or multiple choice. If you choose multiple choice, you can only ask one question and provide options. It is recommended for giving a question where they can have options to choose from. Short answer is where students can give their personal answer. For this demonstration, I'll choose short answer. Let's type a question here and add instruction if needed. Below, we can add attachment and create one here. Assign points and due date. Below, you also have two other options. If you check student can reply to each other, you let students see and comment on other students' answer. It is recommended for a student to have their collaboration and brainstorming. If you check student can edit answer, you allow students to edit their answer after they submitted it. It is recommended for having recitation and giving a student a second chance to revise their answer. To give score on students' responses, click the Turn In. Select one student and give a corresponding score. Return the response and you can add private comment. Click Return to finish. Make sure all responses are graded. And don't forget to give positive feedback and encouraging words. Assigning question has uncountable possibilities to stimulate students' mind and leads to a meaningful discussion. If this video helps you a lot, give a like and share to the people you think who needs to see it. And don't forget to subscribe. That would be all for now. My name is Sir Kevin and thank you for watching. See you on my next video.